So A, find dy over dx for each of the following function. So A, y is equal to 3 over 4, x over 6 minus 1 to the power of 4. So this is a constant, so you can directly multiply. So 4 times 3 over 4, so 3 times 4. So this one is x over 6 minus 1. So you minus the power with 1, you get 3. And then you differentiate uh, inside the bracket. See, you bring the power forward. You just multiply with the number in front of you. 4 times 3 over 4, you will directly get 3. And then you don't touch uh, the one in the bracket. Minus the power with 1. And then you differentiate what is inside the bracket. So here 3x over 6 minus 1 cube. So when you differentiate this one, you get 1 over 6. So 3 times 1 over 6, you get 3 over 6 or 1 over 2. So here x over 6 minus 1 cube. So b, y is equal to 1 over 12, then x minus 3 to the power of 6. So here you get, so this is constant. So you can directly multiply 1 over 12 times 6, you get 1 over 2, right? Never mind. So 10x minus 3, so you minus the power with 1. 6 minus 1, you get 5. And then you differentiate what is inside. So this one is 10x minus 3. So here you get 2, 1 over 2, 10x minus 3, power of 5. When you differentiate inside it, so 10x you get 10. Negative 3, you differentiate, you get 0. So here you get 5, 10x minus 3 to the power of 5. So C, Y is equal to 8 over 2 minus 5x. So we see here we can bring the power up. So we get power of negative 1. So here, dy over dx is equal to, so you bring the power forward, you get negative 8. So here would be 2 minus 5x, and then you minus the power with 1. Negative 1 minus 1, you get negative 2. So this one, d over dx, then you differentiate what is inside. So you get negative 8, 2 minus 5x, negative 2. So when you differentiate what is inside, so 2 will become 0, negative 5x will become negative 5. So here, negative 8 times negative 5, you get 40. So this one is 2 minus 5x, power of negative 2. The power cannot be negative, so you just bring it down, 2 minus 5x, power of 2. D. So y is equal to x minus 1 over x to the power of 3. So you get x minus, so this one you can bring the power up, 3. So dy over dx is equal to, so you bring the power forward, you get 3. So x minus x negative 1, so you minus the power with 1, you get 2. So you differentiate what is inside, so x minus x negative 1. So here... 3x minus x negative 1 power of 2. When you differentiate x, you get 1. When you differentiate x negative 1, so you multiply the power with front. So this is negative x or negative 1. Negative 1 times negative 1, you get positive. So x, then you minus the power with 1. Negative 1 minus 1, you get negative 2. So here you get 3. So here, after you have done the you have done the differentiation, you can uh, bring the negative power down. So x minus so x negative one is equal to one over x power of two, and this one is one plus so x to the power of negative two one is so e y is equal to one over cube root three minus nine x. So here you can bring, so here I'm going to just show 3 minus 9x. Cube root is equal to power 1 over 3. Then you want to bring the power up, so 3 minus 9x, power of negative 1 over 3. So here you have y, so dy over dx is equal to, so you bring the power forward, so negative 1 over 3, and then 3 minus 9x, so you minus the power with 
1. Negative 1 over 3 minus 1. And then you differentiate what is inside. 3 minus 9x. So here you get negative 1 over 3. 3 minus 9x. Negative 1 over 3 minus 1. You get negative 4 over 3. So here. You get negative. When you differentiate. 3 will become 0. Negative 9x. You will get negative 9. So here. Negative 9 times negative 1 over 3. You will get 3. So 3 minus 9x. Negative 4 over 3. So 3 over, you bring the power down. So 3 minus 9x, 4 over 3. So power 4 over 3 is equal to cube root to the power of 4. So here we have cube root 3 minus 9x to the power of 4. So f, so f y is equal to third x square plus 6x plus 6 which is equal to x square plus 6x plus 6 power of 1 over 2. So dy over dx is equal to, so you bring the power forward, so you get x square plus 6x plus 6, and then you minus the power with 1, so 1 over 2 minus 1, and then you differentiate what is inside. So here 1 over 2, so x square plus 6x plus 6, 1 over 2 minus 1, you get negative 1 over 2. So when you differentiate this one, x square you get 2x, 6x you get plus 6. So here you get half, so you see here this one is half and this one can be factorized, right? So half, so 2x plus 6, you can take out number 2, so x plus 3. So it's times divide by. So this one, the power of negative, you can bring it down. So you get x squared plus 6x plus 6 to the power of half. So here you get x plus 3. And power of half is equal to third x squared plus 6x plus 6.